Hey, everybody. That was amazing, too. <laughs> we keep doing it. Love it. We're just too awesome for, you know, the internet. Sorry, Alex. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, I feel that. It'll be it'll be so nice one day when I play a game that's not online. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. Yes. Agreed. All right, so where did we last leave off? Uh, we left off with Johnny Rocket completely annihilating a uh, hound with his sp- with his speed force. Sorry. Yeah. Well, <clears throat> we shall see. So let What's me. The plan? Yeah, go ahead and uh, click your air cushion for me again, or your air mm-hmm. spinning arms. <laughs> Kick. Boom. There we go. Perfect. I need to make a dodge save. He is vulnerable because he's basically surprised by Johnny Rocket here. Mm-hmm. We're all surprised by Johnny Rocket. Even me. <laughs> I surprise me. Um, so Johnny, he is a minion. You do zip in. He does uh, suffer the full effect of whatever you want to accomplish upon him. <laughs> well, in that case, I pretty much knock him out. Excellent. <clears throat> so yeah, the uh, okay. the hound goes flying before he has the chance to uh, before he has the chance to say no, no. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, you do attract the attention of a couple of the Imperium troopers who are, you know, sort of lingering around this area. Um, but that brings us to Thunderbolt, because we're still in the sort of surprise situation. It's unfortunate for them, because we're in the mood to hit something. Mm. Daedalus is in danger. Well, Troy? Yes, I... <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure what I'm... <laughs> I am going... your turn to go, you could blast somebody. <laughs> I will do so. Um, I am... Uh, I, this... The, oh, I see what we're doing. Sorry. <laughs> um, I had a different window up um, over my window. So um, I I am going to... Uh, we, what do we have? The... Um, the... Uh, yeah, not the, the hound, but... The, the troopers. The troopers. Yes, 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 yes. Um, I am going to... I'm gonna run some uh, thunderbolt at them. How many are there? Oh, uh, there's just a few of them. Yeah, you imagine there's <laughs> you imagine there's one minion group of them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna thunderbolt at them. Uh, thunderbolt of lightning. Very very frightening. Galileo. <laughs> oh my! God! <laughs> no. So what? I don't even know. Yeah, what happens? Uh, they are not Queen fans, is what you have learned about yeah, the Imperium. Right, yeah. Clearly. <laughs> oh, wow. My dice have just been rotten. I need, like, an Owen to hug or something. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, well. Okay, Centuria will fix this. Right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, do you want me to tear the door off the cell or get the robot guys? Or maybe tear the door off the cell and hit the robot guys with the door? Tear the well, arms off the, and hit the... That, <laughs> that, that, like that plan? The troopers are probably not robots, just so oh, you know. Oh, sorry. Troopers, <laughs> robots, whatever. Before you rip one of them in half. <laughs> okay, okay. Fair, fair, fair. <laughs> if you tear them in half, juice will come out. <laughs> uh, we don't want to clean any of that up. No. no. But tearing the cell door off and hitting them with it is still an excellent plan. Boom. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Awesome. Um, so you can go ahead and roll this as an unarmed check or as a heavy blow check, however you want to phrase it. Or however you want to shake I it. I shall do that. Let's see. I haven't tried unarmed. Let's let's do that. Oh, a good bet. Awesome. Yeah, 17 is enough to hit. They'll roll a toughness save versus a 27. I can tell you they can't <laughs> roll a 27. Uh, Cent- Centuria, how do you want to how do you want to annihilate this group of minions with the steel door from the uh, from the cell? <laughs> uh, uh, I was kind of envisioning like uh, uh, like grabbing it off the wall and rushing forward like it's a like it's a shield wall and just like <laughs> bowling them back. Awesome. Like bowling pins. Yeah. Like it. Mm-hmm. They actually make that noise when the steel hits their armor. It's a weird function <laughs> in the uh, space steel. Mm-hmm. Strike. Love it. <laughs> and they go scattering, flying away, and you all are left in the robot repair center with Daedalus before you. Perfect. All right. 
I hope now you... we get to see if uh, Lady Liberty can uh, help him out. Yeah. Yeah. What? Uh... What's he doing? Uh, he still seems sort of stupefied. Mm-hmm. Uh, just kind of conjure my little golden shield and push it to his head, I guess. Normally I send it at uh, whatever's whatever's restraining people. Awesome. Um, and this shouldn't have closed my hound sheet. I need to see what his telepathy is. <laughs> um, all right. So, uh, Lady Liberty, you sort of force your golden shield into his brain. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah. It's much more therapeutic than it sounds. Yeah. <laughs> it have to be. <laughs> it's a feeling when the you juice. get that little the head massager thing. <laughs> and, so um, much juice. You are able to free him from the bindings. What does that? Uh, what? How does that all go down, Crystal? Ah, uh, I guess it looks like I'm trying to like do a puzzle cube or something on his head, and then it just sort of <laughs> all unlocks. <laughs> oh, <laughs> wow! That kind of yucky pinata. Uh. <laughs> it's like a Rubik's cube, and you got everything except one sticker, the right color. <laughs> 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 and um. Yeah, you um you sort of manipulate the puzzle cube that is Daedalus's labyrinthine mind, and uh, it uh -huh. snaps in place, and you see the light sort of come back to Daedalus's eyes, and he shakes his head, and he looks like he has a massive headache. Daedalus, oh. you all right? Oh, it is, uh, it's good to see you all here. Um, I'm so glad I didn't scramble your brain. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing. I said scrambled eggs. Oh. Do you want breakfast? <laughs> Breakfast would be great, but if it's breakfast for dinner, I'm not having it. <laughs> um. Noted. <laughs> so stern. Where um, where am I? Where what's happening? You're on Starhaven. What's the last thing you remember? I was on Starhaven, so that's good news. This is you know, well, this, this won't be one of those times that I left intergalactically and found myself on a different planet when I woke up. Um, now we get to the bad news part. Um, notice the uh, Stellar Imperium troopers? Yeah, that's starting to feel f memorable. Um, mm -hmm. uh, we hear from uh, somebody that Starcon is on his way. Dale's eyes sort of open wide, and he says, well, that's not good. Um, yeah, apparently a lot of the residents aren't feeling heard in... Uh in civic matters. Enough that they formed some kind of resistance. Well, that's... Why would they do that? Why would they want to... Why would they want to serve the Starcon? That, that doesn't make any uh, sense. A lot of... There's some... There's an illness going around. Some people are quarantined and sick. That's... I remember that. I was I was trying to solve that problem when, when everything went fuzzy. Um, what do they have? I think somebody poisoned the... Um, the moisture farm. It's bad water. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh. I just never. Uh, yeah, I wasn't. I wasn't prepared for moisture farm. <laughs> mm. So, so sabotage. Sabotage. Yeah, my robots have been getting attacked in the streets too, and Aegis agents have been going missing or showing up injured. But well, we found people smuggling weapons uh, on the refugee shuttle, so... Um... No doubt they have something to do with it. Yep. That means this resistance has a presence on Earth. Some kind of connection. But we might have a more immediate problem, depending on uh, how close Starcon is. It's funny you what should mention that. What kind of long that. range? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Um, there is an explosion outside when you say that, Johnny Rocket. Oh. oh. I spoke too soon. Oh, dear. Courtesy of Spectrum Internet, everyone. <laughs> um, <laughs> and Daedalus kind of looks up. He says, I think uh, maybe you all should go look at that while I find my armor. <laughs> mm. Okay. 
I'll join you if I can. We uh, go and investigate. Yeah, you all do hear, um, sounds like an orbital bombardment of some kind is happening outside. Oh, great! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, I'm betting Starhaven's defenses are down. They sure I guess, are. I guess we can't just hit that with a cell door. <laughs> nope. I mean, you probably could. <laughs> Well, where are the defenses uh, um, located. Uh, uh, located? Yeah, where's the, the where's, power? Where's the on switch? Yeah, yeah exactly. right. Um, yeah. How, how do we <laughs> fix this? The on switch is in the administrative area, um, just sort of the northern point of the star. As, mm -hmm. um, as you all sort of emerge from the manufacturing plant, you can see there are three large Imperium ships uh, above the space of Starhaven that are mm -hmm. you know, just blasting down on where you all are. Um, and there are there are dataless robots and there are Aegis agents you know going to answer that, but there are also some members of the civilian corps who are um, who seem to be trying to stop the dataless robots and all that fun stuff. Mm, that would be the aforementioned resistance, I imagine. Yep. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> are the um, are the ships targeting anything specifically, or does it seem to be like just uh, random destruction? Seems almost like random shock and awe tactics. Um, okay. Okay. And, they're not trying to take down any specific target. That's fine. Mm -hmm. No, but okay. and there are a, there are a great deal of drop pods and other things that are beginning to drop soldiers into the city. Um, All right, Johnny Rocket, you've dealt with the Starcon before. You recognize his personal shuttle is touching down in the central sort of um, sort of residential area. All right, that's where we gotta go. Follow your lead. Yep. <laughs> I mean, I, I, w I don't really have a choice. You're a speedster. I have to follow your lead. <laughs> All right. Um, we uh, head in that uh, direction. Beautiful. Awesome. You guys start heading in that direction. And sure enough, sorry, let me zoom in a little bit more and scroll that over there so it looks good in the window. You all find a great flaming conflagration of buildings and Imperium troopers moving around, and you can see Starcon at this point floating above one of these large central buildings on his, you know, his rocket thrusters, looking sort of imperious down at everyone. How high up is he? Uh, he's about, he's about four stories off the ground. And I'll drag out oh, yeah, tokens for you all. What's the big I-M? That is an Imperium oh. mech. Oh. I, couldn't... I thought we won one okay. million dollars. I was worried that it was going to be... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Troopers are so tiny. <laughs> like little ants. What is Why? the colony for ants? <laughs> Beautiful. So I have pulled all of you out here. Uh, we can go mm -hmm. ahead and enter combat since you all uh, have the interest of stopping the Starcon, I assume. Yep. Uh, I don't know. I want to hear his political platforms. Right. <laughs> I mean, he might be the uh, reformer we need. And just you are subscribing to the newsletter at this point, I think. <laughs> That's true. Are we rolling initiative? Is that what we're doing? Yep. Go yep. Ahead. Click your token first. Where are you talking? Then you to roll aggressively average. I will be able to deliver on that. Yeah. Sorry, <laughs> my screen is uh it's loading up. No worries, I'm grabbing Not all my uh, grabbing all my bad guys. <laughs> bad news bears these bad guys are <laughs> okay well I mean it's it's no you know 47 but <laughs> perfectly respectable I'll take it over whatever else I was rolling <laughs> jeez that was bad and the troopers get to the troopers Thanks to everybody watching. We're glad we're back as well. Taking suggestions on 
you know, how I should... Who, how, in what way I shall electrify. Um, <laughs> I'll do a little shaka con. <laughs> yes! Oh, I'm taking one oh, of your yeah. hero points away. Oh, <laughs> <my God. laughs> I earned it. I did. I uh, did. I, you I did. knew it. And you, I deserve, been, you deserve everything that's coming. <laughs> I was sitting on that for a long time, and I was just like, don't let it out. Don't, and then it just came out. I just, yeah. I'm going to shock a con. I think I broke my occipital uh, bone. My eyes rolled so hard. <laughs> um, I don't do this for you. I do it for the people who are watching at home. And a little for yourself. A little, mostly, mostly. actually for myself. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Johnny, to the what? surprise of no one, Johnny Rocket is on first with 47. Right. Okay. Johnny Rocket also can't fly. Jeez, and I'm still this, laughing. This is also true. Um, uh, yeah, I think that uh, Johnny is going to uh, take down some of these troopers um, because odds are good that nothing I got is going to hurt Starcon. Uh, so it is going to be up to uh, our heavier hitters. Uh, to uh, take him down. All right. Um, Johnny is going to uh, take the uh, closest group of troopers and uh, do a fast attack to take him down. Awesome. I do need you all to know that somebody in the chat has said that I'm supposed to wipe you out. All of them. Oh, no. Uh, yeah. It was just a pun. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make them pay for my sin. All right, Johnny, do your worst. Mm. Worst is it's pretty bad. Yeah, that's pretty that's bad. That's pretty I'm rough. I'm uh, going to spend the hero point on that. That's actually a burst mm. area, so you don't have to roll to hit. Oh, it's an area attack. I don't oh. need to do that. Yeah, I'll give you your hero point back. Give me my hero point back. <laughs> you know, you, you could have centered that, like, right in between all of that. I think that I should, yes. I'm willing to allow it. All right. Was it a 30-foot burst? Yeah. So. Yeah. yeah, right there. It, yeah. Nice! Look at that! So start from there. Excellent. So that's a, lot of, that's a lot of people getting punched. That's a lot of running around and punching. I love it. All right, so the, I'll go with the mech first. He's looking at a DC 18 dodge. He fails the dodge save. Go figure. Uh, toughness versus DC 25. The mech will take a bruise in a daze. Good job, Johnny. Nice. Damn. Nicely done. You punched out a mech. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> you punched out a mech. <laughs> I had a plus 16 to that roll. <laughs> uh, oh, oh. And you annihilated him. Well, you gave him a bruise in a day, so annihilate's a strong word. Right. Dodge. The first group of troopers will fail. The second group of troopers will fail. So one of them did roll a 25 on the toughness save, so that group is okay, but the other group is taken out. Yikes. Apparently nice. they made the troopers out of the stuff they make the mechs out of, and the mechs out of the <laughs> stuff they make the troopers out of. <laughs> And then the hound that's right there, he's going to roll and probably get knocked way out. It's hard out here for a, for an Imperium trooper. Yeah. All right, yeah, that'll take the hound out. So good job, Johnny. What happens? Hard for uh, yeah. skinny, pale type psychic types in space. Right. We don't have any of those weird interdictor just to cars. Can't yeah, I'm better, we better hope not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure yet. <laughs> Maybe I have that. <laughs> All right. You know, um, it's the big scary ones that always travel with hounds. Right. <laughs> yeah. There's... None of those are out here. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm glad you mentioned that because I was looking up yeah. WebMD. I was like, what could that be? Maybe I have it. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Uh, good job, Johnny. So um, you go flying in and you just completely start throwing punches all over the courtyard right there. Freedom League, take them down. Do, 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 do. Excellent. Who's next? The Starcon's next. Mm. Uh. 
I hate that guy. I don't like that. I hate that guy. Mm-hmm. And he'll, uh, he'll float over just it, all superior and mighty just above the ground where Johnny Rocket is so he still can't reach him. He'll say, Johnny, did you really bring a group of children here to face me? What? I'm a grown-ass man. <laughs> <laughs> of course I didn't, Starcon. I brought a group of heroes here to face you. Oh, oh inspirational! Nice. <laughs> very nice, very nice. <laughs> Alex liked that Starcon did not. <laughs> <laughs> so, the system is under the protection of the Freedom League, Ken and Khan. You and your forces need to leave now. This is just one, one hop away from Earth. I'm taking this planet as the staging ground of my conquest of your tiny world. And uh, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make I'm gonna make your kids watch you die in front of them, and he'll blast you. <laughs> uh, but he only gets a twenty to hit, so that's not gonna work. Nope. <laughs> you have to do better than that. Yeah. Troopers, deal with them. <laughs> the troopers are like, dude, are you serious? <laughs> Those of you that are still standing. We just saw you trip over your own pros. <laughs> uh, the troopers, they only have... Eh, I guess there's a couple of them over there. They're uh, The ones right next to Johnny are going to open fire on Johnny. I don't think it's going to go super well for them. But we'll see. 19's not going to hit Johnny's dodge DC. And then this group from the south here is going to come up a little bit. And um, they're going to take a pot shot at Lady Liberty. Ah. Oh, rude. 23 hey, to hit all... the dodge, DC. That'll hit me. Please give me a tough to save. 16. It's going to be one bruise for Lady Liberty. So are we, uh, is Lady Liberty and all of us kind of clustered over here on the left, or are we in moving into the the fight? Mm-hmm. Right. As, as our initiative turns come up. I gotcha. Five fair. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. And it is Centuria's turn. Okay. Well, I am going to, uh, do I... Do I not, uh, not, does Centuria, not Nicole, know anything about this guy, <laughs> like his weaknesses and stuff? Because I don't. Um, his only real weakness is he's real arrogant. <laughs> but oh, he doesn't good. have like a, he doesn't have like a, um, like a kryptonite or anything like that. But he is very, he's very tactically minded, but he's also very sure of his own abilities. And he knows he is destined one day to rule the whole universe and nobody can stop him. And you were all, all right. insects before well, him. Well, I'm going to insect my way up there then. And, uh, <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> um, <laughs> Ant Man all over again. I'm, I'm going to all out attack him. I'm going to, you know, extra effort him. I'm going to, I'm going to show him that five foot six can make him pay. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. Go punch yourself a space elf. I believe in you. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> I'll fly up there and right her. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, in that. Oh, that's not good. Although I did did want to. Uh, I was just looking at your notes about uh, all-out attacks or mm -hmm. whatever. Yeah, um, so with all-out attack, what you can do, um, before you roll, you can say, hey, I want to take up to five off of my dodge and parry to add five to my to hit to make it easier mm -hmm. for you to hit. Uh, it also makes you easier to get hit because you're sort of unleashing everything that you have to unleash. Right. Yep. Yeah, this is my I hope you guys are here to back me up move. I'm going to try. That's a good yeah. move. That's a good move. Um... So, Centuria, if you want to, you could spend a hero point to reroll. To uh, I will do that. Awesome. I will spend my hero points where I have to throw out here. Yes? Are you going for the full five on, like, uh, minus... Yes. Okay. I am doing the full five because why not? Excellent. I mean, what Bring can it. happen? Die? <laughs> 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 the 
power of youth. I'm 17. I'm not gonna die. Yeah, it's headlong <laughs> into the. To be fair, there is a precedent for centurions dying in this universe, but you know, don't even worry about that. <laughs> yeah, that's but... nothing. That's... I tried to bring that up. Well, then, then I'll be. <laughs> that was Once Omega. Again, Omega's way father's, worse than Starcon. Uh... Uh, okay, um, so once again, uh, re-rolling with my extra five. Perfect. So with the extra five, that'll take you up to a 22. Ooh. Uh, 22 will hit him. Nice. Oh, thank God. <laughs> that is a solid hit. <laughs> that is, That's yeah. why she said, luck. <laughs> That's right. They said that hit in Pittsburgh. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody in Ferroberg's teeth are just rattling. <laughs> right. All oh, right, man. Uh, Five foot six of this. So I gotta roll. <laughs> Uppercut. <laughs> gotta roll. Uh, he does get a twenty-seven for his toughness save, so he will take a bruise. Ooh. Nice. A good save. But yeah, that was a good hit. Uh, what happens, Centuri, as you rock it into him and sort of go all uh, out? I I come up from below and and like hit him in the jaw my my hope is to rocket his head back like whiplash snap um kind of uh you know make him sh shake shake himself back to full focus and hopefully give my folks uh, an opportunity awesome um i know you mentioned you wanted to do extra effort so what you can do if you want to you can um you can go fatigued and do another attack if you want um, or you could spend a hero point and make that extra attack and not go fatigue. The penalty of fatigue is that you are only able to move at half your regular speed. I will go fatigue. All right. Because I'm right up on him. Beautiful. And if he goes away, somebody else can get him. <laughs> <laughs> Look I'm, at my confidence. I'm going to get away from the centurion that's, the centurion that's punching me. That's a good move. <laughs> 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 that's just that's good mar marketing. That okay. is, yeah. So, one more? Yeah, go ahead. One more time? With a fatigue. Badass. Oh, that's a, 20, oh. that's a 27 to hit, so, ouch. Bam. Wow. Now feel my left cross! <laughs> <laughs> um, so he did get a 33 on that toughness save. It shakes it off. Damn. So, you come in, you give him a real powerful bam, his head snaps back. You go in and hit him with a second one, just throwing all of your fury behind it. He catches your hand and says, that is enough, child. <laughs> wow. <Ooh>. Okay. All right. <laughs> your turn, guys. Here I come. Uh, I'm going to find bolt. myself. <laughs> beep, beep. <laughs> kapow, kapow. All right, so how? So I'm trying to think of, like, uh, four stories. I'm. What I'm wanting to do is to get uh, Hover in so that I can have him and the uh any mechs on the ground if there are any um and then i want to do a um blackout mm -hmm. awesome hopefully shut his stuff down um make him fall to the ground and not do what he was going to do to uh to centuria and then uh yeah so that's what i'm gonna do Pew. Ah! <laughs> what Oh. So the good news is the good news is you don't have to worry about it because it's a burst area. I actually have to roll to avoid it. Right. Um, oh, right. I don't know what you I did to not... upset roll twenty, but I've done it. I mean, jeez, I thought we were friends. You have been letting Premus touch your dice again. Okay. Yeah, never yeah. do that. Never do yeah. that. Premus touched the internet. Then, yeah. Then, then, then we have to get a Greek Orthodox priest in here. And <laughs> right. A young, a young and old. A young right. one and an old one. A young one and an old one. This is unbelievable. I'm, uh, yeah. I mean, you know, par for the course, honestly. But, um, but good news. The um, it will take half effect. So let me see. Let me have it make a save against that half effect. Uh, the mech is <laughs> not shut down. Boo. Um, Starcon, however, I'll roll Starcon. Yeah, it was. Starcon roll dodge for the burst area. Okay, he will succeed on the dodge check for the burst area, and then he will roll. Um, I guess I'll just roll one of his tech, which is just a d20 plus 12. Uh, 
All right, I got a 15, so I will allow okay. you to shut down one of his abilities. You can take away um, his flight ability. You can take away his staff. Which is uh, a primary attack. Okay, like uh, the, we're talking to his, uh, his stick, not his staff that are attending to him. <laughs> right. Yeah, I just, well, all the staff can go home. Yeah. Go yeah, home. Yeah, he gets hairdresser. Yeah, right. yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The butler, the all, all of them gone. Gardner, you're done. Uh, yeah, I, I'm gonna go for. for uh, this is a tough one. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I would have probably. Farts. No, sorry. Um, I'm gonna. It'll be a staff. I'm gonna knock a staff out. Awesome. So the staff powers down. That's annoying. Okay. What do you want to do? How does it look, Thunderbolt? How does it go down? <laughs> that's all. That's what it does. Mm. And, and then it then it like deflates like a ribbon, <laughs> like a deflated snake. Dramatic. Breathed, breathed in electricity. Yes. Yes, that too. <laughs> God, Beautiful. I cannot believe I rolled a. That is something. Ah. But good job, Thunderbolt. The mech's turn. Uh, the mech sees what Thunderbolt is doing. He's going to lift up this big old chain gun and just shoot a whole bunch of holes into Thunderbolt. <laughs> Rude. Right. Bracka, 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 bracka. 26 to hit your dodge, DC. Sure it will. My yeah. dodge, DC. Whoops, sorry. Uh, yeah, 18. Okay, I will need a toughness save, please. You're looking at a DC 27, because there is multi-attack on the chain gun. All right, looking for toughness, looking for... There it is. Boom. Ha! Oh! That's nothing. They just don't make mechs... <laughs> so, they don't make mechs like they used to. <laughs> or I'm just real tough. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> um, and that mech was dazed, so that is all the mech can do. Nice. The remaining hound is going to come scuttling over this way. Much like the pirate robots from earlier. Mm -hmm. and, singing? Uh, no, not singing. Scuttling. <laughs> Scuttling. No. <laughs> wow, everybody's into sea shanties this day. <laughs> right? <laughs> it's a real, yeah. Uh, I didn't know they had TikToks in the Imperium. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what's going on. <laughs> and uh, Centuria, I would like for you to roll a will save, please. Gotcha. Oh, did I? It showed up. It did show yep. up. It, it did show up. Okay. Um, Centuria, so that's going to be a bruise and a daze from this attack. Um, mm -hmm. Just to let you know, a daze makes it so that you can only do a standard or a move action next round. Do I have to record that? I don't know. No, you don't have to. Well, uh, in the character sheet, if you go to injuries and click that up one, that'll lower your toughness for future rolls. But you don't have to mark down the days. I'll just keep a track of it. Okay. So, yeah, he comes um, He comes charging four on all four, sort of foaming at the mouth with his car collar around his neck. And he stops and he lifts both his hands up toward Centuria. And you feel the psychic pulse just sort of hit the back of your head, Centuria. And you scream a little bit as you feel something scrambling your eggs. Yikes. <laughs> Not my eggs. Oh, no. <laughs> Lady <laughs> Liberty. <laughs> well, I just got blasted last round, so I'm picking myself up out of the rubble and pulling my cape back, and there's a little alien child that I've, like, shield shielded from these blasts that runs off, and I stand up and float in the air, and these people have been on the run for years. On the run from you! And you've tricked them into thinking you're some kind of liberator so you could do this? We're gonna take you down! So everybody, inspire! Nice! Hey. Hey. It's a plus two bonus next round. That worked in real life too, I'm ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling it. I am too, I am. Right. Starcon's a little and bit I'm like, wow, I am an asshole, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> and I am going to spend some extra effort to plow right into this hound. Excellent. Nice. So, <laughs> there we go. I'm just imagining Lady Liberty jumping off of the roof and just tackling him and beating him up in the street. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, 21 to hit. Oh, 20, 23. 21 will definitely hit. Oh, no. 
Yeah, I rolled a 13. Where Lady Liberty's backhand slap comes in handy. Right. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah, Lady Liberty, how do you take him down? Get out of my down? friend's eggs! <laughs> 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 uh, uh, so good. <laughs> so yeah, you pummel him into the ground. He's unconscious now. Oh, Perfect. Good job, Lady Liberty. Johnny Rocket. Eat that! I liberated him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did. Alright. Um, I am gonna... Uh, these troopers are too far apart. I'm gonna take out this uh, group of uh, troopers over by uh, the mech. Uh, they're well within my radius. So. Add two to that. Right. Oh, but it's a burst area, so you don't have to worry about it. I was going to say it's not a check. All right, the troopers roll a dodge save. First group, or the only group, they fail, so they'll roll toughness. And they fail by a lot, so you take out another group of troopers, Johnny. What happens if you go uh, annihilating? Uh, so uh, Johnny takes out the uh, troopers uh, and... Uh, dropping the uh, last one, uh, he uh, sort of hefts the uh, the trooper's weapon uh, before and just dropping it uh, to the ground. You're running out of troops and weapons, Starcon. Well, do you want to know what's even better? <laughs> I forgot that the mech was at range of that. Um, I rolled two natural ones in a row for the mech. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> and then, just as Johnny says that, there's a poing <laughs> and the next one of the next legs comes apart. So good, so good. <laughs> oh, and I found a wrench. <laughs> <laughs> nice. This is Boom. great. Mm. Very, very well done. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't bring enough soldiers from the Imperium. This is that's my problem. That's my fault. <laughs> My bad. You know what? <laughs> Never mind. Backseas, I'm going to go now. Um, man, Starcon's not having a good time. Starcon is going to fly down sort of between Centuria and Thunderbolt. And he is going to... Uh, he's going to use some martial arts on y'all since you took his staff away. Uh, he's going to use his multi-attack on his damage here. Um, so he'll get a minus two to hit whatever he rolls just to hit both of y'all uh, he does get a 23 to hit both of your parry DCs uh, for Centuria and Thunderbolt 18 yes. parry and uh that's 16 minus 5 right now yeah yeah. yeah. 11 <laughs> alright so I need toughness saves from Thunderbolt and Centuria you guys are looking for can a can I use Interpose yeah you sure can I'm gonna take that hit for Centuria Ooh. Excellent. Oh, damn it. So, Lady Liberty jumps into the front of the attack for Centuria. Oh, <laughs> yikes. Oh, yikes. <laughs> oh, but I. Oh, you're the <laughs> one who can take him out! <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Centuria, you do get a bruise in a day. Or, sorry, uh, Lady Liberty, you get a bruise in a days. And ah. uh, Thunderbolt, you also get a bruise in a days. Yay! So yeah, you incapacitate. Uh, you you and you immobilize his staff, and he just throws it to the ground. And he comes over. He raises both his fists, and he gives you a couple of good kidney punches before turning to Haymaker Centuria before Lady Liberty's face gets in the way of the closed palm fist. No, oh, no. Oh. oh, that's how you do it. <laughs> <laughs> you said you needed us to have your back. Yep. That was my front, but, um, thank you <laughs> I'm giving Centuria a hero point. <laughs> well earned, well earned. Mm -hmm. Um, so the Starcon, he is, uh, he will cede his turn at that point. He is done. The last group of Imperium troopers is going to come over here and just, I don't know, I guess they're just going to throw rocks at you guys or something. 
uh, with their blast <laughs> rolls. Just be irritating. Yeah. Here we go, Johnny. No, 22 is not going to hit you, so you're good. Nope. Uh, Centuria. What would you like no. to do? Ah, this guy is really annoying. <laughs> I do want to let you know, um, Nicole, that you can mix all-out attack and power attack if you want to. It'll You won't get the same yep. bonus to hit, but you can basically nullify your penalty to hit and get a plus five to damage. So if you really, really want to hurt him, that is an option. That's the way to go. Yeah. Uh, I do want to do that. Just tell me what buttons to push. <laughs> uh, just look at this character sheet. <laughs> You've got a plus two from Inspire, too. Right. Oh, that's true. Oh, right. Uh, Troy would have had plus two to that toughness save from my Inspire, so would he that would have... not be dazed. He would not be dazed. It'd just be a bruise. Ah, nice. Well done. Nice. Nice Good catch. Job. <laughs> Good job. Lady Liberty's yeah, just so, catching um, everything out here. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> the punches and the points and the... I'm, yeah. I'm not a powerhouse, but what I do, I do okay. <laughs> yep. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I don't know how to make all that happen. Uh, um, so you don't have to do anything, you just have to go ahead and roll your attack and we'll do the mental math on our end. That's what I love. <laughs> right, <laughs> yeah. Um, Man, Mutants and Masterminds just... Matt disguised as Batman. Right? <laughs> uh, do, so if I go for my heavy blow here... Um, yeah. yeah. Yep. That's fine. Yep, you'll actually get Perfect. a total of plus two to hit on top of your regular bonus. Oh. So that is a 20 to hit. That's not enough to hit. But you can oh, spend a hero point a hero if you point? want. Oh, I'm absolutely spending a hero point. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Like candy. Reroll. No, this is good news. So that's a 19 plus. Yeah. So that's a 23. That's a 25 to hit. Okay. Which is enough to hit. <laughs> oh, right. oh, okay. Good. Because the initial roll is. Is a 9. Like a 3. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. I got it. All right, Centurion. So that's a DC 36 punch that you just Whew. delivered to Starcon's mouth and. Eyes, a sort of facial <laughs> body part. The, the yeah, upper right. quadrant. <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh man, here we go. What am I gonna get? Was that thirty six? Uh, uh Starcon got a twenty six, so that is a bruise in a daze, almost a stagger. I'll take a. Daze. Oh no, but he does yeah. have a bruise, so that does knock down to twenty five. Yeah, already bruised. So staggered. He is staggered. That's a good, good hit. That was a nicely hit. done. <laughs> well, yeah, it's all my little five foot six frame can do. <laughs> <laughs> Just yeah. yeah, your five foot six frame that can bench press on ocean liner. Yeah, all your all your frame can do is crack the jaw of the galaxy's biggest marauder. Yeah. <laughs> My whole Excuse face. Me, I'll, be right, I'll, I'll be right back. I've got to get a. I got to get a ship out of the Suez Canal, and then I'll be right back. <laughs> right, <laughs> right. Yes, exactly. Ah, uh, the stream is. Oh. Uh, they are just way into this. Yeah. Oh my lord, Al. Poor Starcon. <laughs> um, are you happy with that being the end of your turn, or do you want to do anything else in turn? <laughs> <laughs> no. Um. No, I. I kind of. You know, maybe maybe get around behind him so he can't hit me again. Hmm. Position myself just slightly out of range. I don't know if he wants to hit you again. <laughs> <laughs> all I, right, all right, I get I it. I mean, what he should really learn from this is don't beat up Centuria's friends. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah. How much of an ass whooping do you need? Okay, so um, <laughs> where is his staff? Uh, it is on the ground. Um, yes. I want to grab it and use it on him. Uh oh. That's bad pool. That's bad cricket. Yep. <laughs> Dirty Sorry. Pool. That's the expression. Bad, Dirty, Dirty bad pool. Dirty pool, yeah. Sticky wicket, I think mm. you were thinking about. <laughs> <laughs> so is you that know, like a technology check or a... Um, so the good news is because your nullify is built by you, you can just switch the nullify off so you can turn the staff back oh. on. Um, <sighs> so, hmm, how do I want to do this? Um, <laughs> it was like, how... <laughs> Joys of this game. Um, okay, so actually, we're gonna call this. We're gonna. I'm gonna have you roll your regular lightning bolt check, but I'm gonna give you a plus. Um, a plus two to your damage because the staff. Okay. Because you're channeling it through the staff. 
Mm -hmm. That's that's tough but fair. <laughs> Get to add a plus two to that. Mm -hmm. uh, that's wanna. that's gonna I'm gonna, miss. I'm gonna spend a. Uh, wait, I, did I really not lose a hero point for my bad pun? <laughs> no, no, I, I was kidding. That's kidding. I don't take hero points away. I hold I future I, ones at bay. I, I, I there we go. All right, I'm borrowing joy from the future. Is what you're saying. All right. Mm. Um, all right, so we'll do this again. Uh, lightning bolt, lightning bolt. Hey, that's a little better. Yeah, that's a lot better. Yeah, plus uh, two. Plus two is a twenty. Plus you rolled a ten on the dice, so that's a tw that's a twenty-eight thirty to hit. Nice. So that's DC twenty-nine because of the uh, the staff you're using. Man, y'all are some tough cookies out here. Yeah. Finally. All the kids kicking all the butts. All right, Thunderbolt, I rolled a 10 on my toughness save, so how do you want to take Starkon out with his own staff? Oof. Say that again? Uh, you took him down. You how oh, yeah, how do you I want to take him out? how it happens. Take him I was, out. I'm, I'm, I'm just like, what? What? I got the golden ticket? The, uh, <laughs> I'm, well, you know, so I'm going to zap him, and then I'm going to just take the staff and just beat him upside the head with it and then oh. uh, and yeah just uh and then when so he'll he's already he's still floating right he's still kind of hovering up in the air i mean probably so, not after you knock him out but yeah yeah I was gonna say, <laughs> as, as, he, as he hits the ground i'm gonna hit the ground on top of him with the staff and just be like hit him. How, do you, how do you like me now i kind of like the idea of him getting like all imperious like Announcing his titles, and I'm gonna be the biggest, baddest guy to ever kick your butts. That's and it. From behind him, it's just like, yes, <laughs> it. It. very like, yeah, he like meeting like like note for note your inspirational tone, but then he, <laughs> then he gets hammered and donezo. And, Troy's like, boo, 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 boo. <laughs> and one more for good measure. Right? Yeah. <laughs> wow. Beautiful. Um. Yeah, these guys are going to surrender when you take out uh, Starcon. We give up. Yeah, I hope so. We give They're up. like, we're not him. <laughs> that was uh, very fulfilling. <laughs> it <laughs> rolls so badly. Oh, I mean, wow. They Starcon punch me? I'm so cool. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yes. yeah, you all, um, you all put out the fire as you all start, you know, you know rounding up the resistance members. <laughs> Um, rounding up sounds like they have a bad fate ahead of them. Probably not right. with you all. Right, we'd probably I negotiate mean, or talk or they, like... Or they, they want to join the Imperium, we can ship them out to the Imperium. Right. We can send right. them away on the Imperium's shuttle. Right. But the Imperium can't have any part of our solar system. Correct. <laughs> That's imminently that. reasonable. <laughs> That's way too close to home. <laughs> yeah. Um... But yeah, you all sort of, you know, wrap, right. um, you take care of the rest of Starhaven, you sort of decide the fate Mr. of... Mr. Khan, before you leave, could I get your autograph? No. <laughs> not now. <laughs> ah, it's not now, when? No, no. Well, while he's unconscious, we'll, we'll bloody, bloody thumbprints, and, and it'll be fine. You can keep it sure, forever. Sure, sure, Just like a handprint. <laughs> right. <laughs> From that time we knocked him down. Yeah. Poor Star Khan. I got one of his teeth. <laughs> uh, I um, think it's time to head out. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Data the chances was, of that growing into some kind of force-grown clone in our trophy room are practically next to nothing. Yeah. <laughs> minimal, minimal, like minimal. Oh, good, a sequel. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um. So yeah, you all sort of restore order to Starhaven and. Uh, you're free to head back to Earth, having saved Europa from a fate from being conquered by the, the Imperium. So, congratulations, Ooh. everybody. That's all I've got. Well for you. You, know, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go get a milkshake. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I'm going to go to the library and brood. <laughs> no, you're not. You're getting dragged out to get milkshakes. <laughs> these kids. I... I get a dry cell at the hardware store and I put a straw in it. <laughs> there we go. That's very thoughtful. Very thoughtful. And tasty. I love it. 
You know, there's this great place down by the pier that has uh, really good milkshakes. Energy mm -hmm. drinks. <laughs> heard that. <laughs> I've heard that. <laughs> I heard that, yeah. Uh, well, thank you, Alex. This is Absolutely, yes. Alex. What a yeah. blast, honestly. That was, uh, that was a ton of fun. I just love that it had all the... Um, it had all the elements that we needed to kind of keep things together, and then I finally got a good role. I mean, that's all. Yes. <laughs> right. That's the the journey you can forgive. It's the you know, how do we yeah. close it up? But uh, that was great. All the, yeah. the characters Thank were fun. You, yeah, yeah, really a, a great time. Um, we do have a request for the um, sea shanty, and um, I might have accidentally made them think that we have a space shanty. So if you can whip <laughs> something up there, that'd be. <laughs> uh, I could try to play it again and see if it works. <laughs> Uh, and I we think, have a giveaway, don't we, before we go? You oh, know, yes. we do have a, di a giveaway, and um, I think what we'll do is we actually have um, – the notion was that we were going to give out some uh, Mutants Masterminds player packs and then our bundle and then a GM bundle. And so we've really got three things to give away. Um, how do we want to do that? Uh, <laughs> I was, I've was i been reading the comments, and I'm trying to see which uh, – like if there's any – I thought that was your out. job, dude. Right. <laughs> Uh, normally, there'd be some kind game. of a mechanism, like a, a picking system or something. But uh, if you're just asking me, I'm going to, you know, looking at the chat, this isn't fair. But, I, you know, I don't know. Jason's one of your peeps, Alex? He is. I think he owns everything for M&M, though, I think. I, I think we'll find that. I think we'll find that for sure. Um, here's what we're going to do. We've got three things to give away. Um, if you are, uh, send a note to let's play at greenronin.com and then provide some analysis. Provide some analysis of the game and kind of the, the, uh, oh, the function of it. it. Yeah, we're going to make you work for it. And you know what? And if you do something real good, we'll come up with something even better than the prizes that we've got. Um, the other if thing you is. You returned with your own space shanty. <laughs> well, that's a good one too. Everybody gets a robot pirate. <laughs> right. We will accept a shanty. <laughs> we will accept some thoughts on on gameplay, and then um, why don't we do a? Uh, so it's we got seventeen people in chat right now. Um, picking the person is a bit of a challenge because. Do you want just some random numbers there, Troy? Uh, you know, I, I also need to know who the people are. God, if uh, we well, had that's some kind thing. of device that could generate random numbers. I know, right? Yeah, I mean, I've got one of those in my skull, but I also don't know what everybody's, ch what who are in the various chat rooms. We've got three. Mm. Um, that is the problem with having more than one. <laughs> Nightfall says, can I get a signed issue of Immortal Hulk? <laughs> Gosh, do we know anybody who has that? If kind only, of yeah, they very specifically are asking for Crystal to sign it. So, <laughs> well, um, I don't think I have any issues of Immortal. <laughs> I mean, I've got the collections, but spoken I don't think like I've somebody got who works them. in the industry. <laughs> uh, all right, so everybody, I've got any copies of the issue I helped with. Everybody in chat right now, I'm, I've got a number. Uh, pick your uh, pick a number between one and a uh, hundred. Just drop it in chat. You have. Uh, yeah. Ten seconds. Whoever gets the closest <laughs> without going over, better be listening. And Nate keeps trying to roll a dice that ain't there. <laughs> All right. I heard it. All right. The only guess. Guess what? The only person that's following directions right now. Oh, night falls in. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. Fubar. Good. Good. Nate. Okay. See. Sh Sean. Getting it together. She. Yeah. It's the Sean. What's the first one? Yeah. yeah. If you can imagine. Um, mm -hmm. All right. Did I hear a dice roll? I, I rolled a die. What did you get? 69. Matthew. Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got a four. Oh. Oh, no. No? I mean, yes. <laughs> I. Here's the deal. So someone said three and someone said five. So what that means <laughs> is that Sean Vieira wins a thing and Nightfall wins a thing. And we'll, okay. co we'll collude and connect after this. That's a good roll. <laughs> but I just can't believe we netted a Sean. And then... Uh, <laughs> And then Matthew oh, the odds. has yeah. a wide net and a Sean appears. A Sean right. appears, yeah. There will always be a Sean in the net. Yeah. Um, Super effective. All right. And then I'm also going to give one to Matthew Tyler because you're funny. Uh, um, okay, so <laughs> we'll connect after this. If uh, folks do want to write in and share some thoughts on the game or um, share analysis or send a she, a, a she senti. I don't know what mm. a she senti is, but it sounds like Christmas. Um, it sounds fairy, and um, you don't make deals with fairies. Oh, uh, that's that true. That is true. Um, They're not trustworthy. All right, friends. 
<laughs> they are not. No, yeah, they're really not. Uh, all right, uh, thanks. Uh, so that's Nightfall. That's uh, Matthew, and that is uh, Sean. I almost forgot. I'm like, who else? Uh, but that's it, I think. Um, what a what an adventure. Like, yeah, that was great. That was a ton literally. Of fun. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, thank We're you guys. Have to see if we can get the rights to use that art in a uh, in an actual published adventure. Yeah, I know, right? Be nice, wouldn't it? We need more. I mean, we could just hire somebody to get robot pirates, right? <laughs> I mean, we can, but it's also nice to expand our staple of mutants and masterminds artists. Indeed, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. True, yeah, true that. Awesome. Very nice. Um, uh, also, thanks to all the folks who are watching. Go ahead. Um, sorry, Troy, just to let everybody know. No, no, no please, um, go ahead. If you are interested in more Mutants and Masterminds live streams, I do run I do run one every Monday night over on my own yeah. channel at the Untold mm -hmm. Stories Project. Um, we're doing Nether War right now, so um, actually we're doing just guessed a couple times. <laughs> we're doing the part of Nether War that I'm contributing. That wasn't pre published, so Ooh. right now we're in the terminus dealing with an Omega Perfect. dealing with an Omega who has been powered up by Una's magic. So So where would they find you? Uh, uh, Twitch.tv and uh, the Untold Stories Project. I'm nice. sure that Alex's regular players are much better equipped to torture him than we are. <laughs> yes. Yes. They know right. <laughs> Good stuff. Awesome. Uh, what I was going to say is, hey, you know, um, the next um, Thursday with Owen Casey Stevens, um, I will... I that guy. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, I do too. He's just amazing. Um, He's the but, nicest man in gaming. Mm -hmm. And that's what I've heard, and that's what we call him. Um, I will be dis I'll be re disembodied, um, which is good because if I smile for another four hours or whatever, I will go crazy. But um, Wait, did you say disembodied? Oh, oh, Troy, I was ready to disembowel you. Oh no, no, body, yeah, no, no, body, body. Yeah, no, no. The enunciation is important here. It really is. Yeah, it really is. Um, also, um, uh, we'll be opening up for um, NorwestCon, so we're going to start yes. at one o'clock, and we'll be. Uh, streaming for about an hour or so. We're going to be interviewing some of the NorwestCon people. We're going to be talking with Owens. Going to we're going to try to flap him, um, and then just got confirmation in two weeks after that. So it's the third Thursday. We will have friends from um, uh, Drive Through RPG will be on, and we'll have some big announcements. We'll be doing some mm -hmm. great stuff, and so that would be a time to listen if you're interested in things like the Age Creators Alliance and some other things like that. So. Make sure to send a note to let's play at greenronin.com if you want to get more details and don't miss the stream. And speaking of NorwestCon, we're running Green Ronin games all weekend. That's uh, right. For NorwestCon, we have stream games for uh, three different uh, Green Ronin games going this weekend. That's right. Yeah, we've got uh, The Expanse. Um, are you doing a Blue Rose? Uh, I'm doing Blue Rose. Nice. And then, yeah. uh, and then uh, what's the third one? Malcolm. And, um, That's right. And yes. We have a uh, modern age game. Modern age, awesome. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of fun. A lot of mm -hmm. Norwest kind of stuff, and you can watch all of it, and you don't have to pay for it. Right. I'm in. I know what I'm doing. Me too. <laughs> awesome. Again, Alex, thanks so much for you know having this idea about three years ago. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking in chat, and I said, "When did we bring this up?" And he's like, "Well, I brought it up. A, you came back a month later." I was like, "That sounds about right." <laughs> pretty fast for us <laughs> that is a, really, a quick turnaround but uh, yeah and then uh, Crystal and Steve and Nicole for hanging out for this four hours is a lot of fun and everybody that's watching as well uh, hope you enjoyed it as much as we enjoyed playing we had a great time thanks yeah. for yeah. being on I'm sure we will have you again in the future we might we might make Troy wear skin again mm -hmm. <laughs> it's Just so special occasions it's so like hot and moist <laughs> uh. It, it is. It is. Yes. <laughs> I'm still inspired from uh, the inspirational speech. I'm uh, right? fired up, so I'm gonna go do some laundry or something. Yes. <laughs> Take that, oppressors. All right. All right. We will. All right. <laughs> so we'll see you all next time. Thanks, everyone. <laughs>